So I've been noticing a little like critter poop. And uh, one of the reasons why we stopped using this, the girls stopped using it, was because of the fact that they got infested with bats. Well, I moved the stuff down there, and I think that right there is a bat. I, I have to get my glasses, but I'm pretty sure it's a bat upside down. I, I can't see that clear because I broke my glasses, but I'm gonna go get some other glasses. Mm -hmm. And then I gotta make sure that they're not coming back in here because that was a problem before. The bats kept getting in there. They got the bat is Whoa. <laughs> So I just want to kind of snap these together a little bit so I can look. Oh yeah, I see a little feet. That's a bat for sure. Um, now I gotta figure out how to get them out of here. Great. Well, for now I'm just gonna start at this end. Over there. Hopefully, when I take down she rockers, I'm gonna nest them again. And that's just the one guy because there used to be a bunch of them in here, evidently. Started, the more we started for sure. I'm going to go ahead and take this off and let's hope there's not a bunch of bats behind that because it very well could be. As you can see, Getting it a little cleaned up. I gotta figure out where this leak is at. I gotta feel it's running down here and then over and down to here and then coming back out. 
So I'm gonna walk outside and see if I can figure out what's going on because no sense of fixing it when it has a leak, right? I mean, duh. So upon examination, looking at where the water damage starts here, it runs down right on the face of that. I'm guessing it was gonna be this wire, because I'll show you, oops, hold on. This wire, and I'll show you outside what's happened. Uh, but I'm guessing that's where that water was coming in. So if you come out here and you look, I fixed it now. But you see where, where it comes down? It went straight on down into that thing. So the water's coming off, it's just using that as a dang funnel or a rain chain to run right down into the thing. So what I've done is I pushed it out a little bit to where the bottom of it is down low, you see it? So hopefully it run down and then drip off right there and not run into the building. That's the only thing I can think of that um, it looks like it's happening, but needless to say, that, that I think is what's gonna do it. Because again, look at the water damage there, and they're going down, that, um, yeah. We'll fix it. Some of you are asking, so what's your plan with the bat? Well, before I get out of here, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna have to go ahead and pick them up, and I'm gonna use a spire extinguisher to cover the hole. I'll do that now, but I'll, I'll get them out of here that way can still get out. But uh, long story short, because last night, he got to spin inside the uh, announcer's tower. But uh, I gotta figure out how to pick him up though. Check it out. Now this mug came out. You better watch out for that bat, buddy. Then that bat's watching you. So it's looking like I'm about where I'm at now until I get uh, drywall tape, some more drywall mud. And then I start doing what I can to uh, get this all filled in, float it out. And then I'll uh, sand it, texture it, and paint it. And then I'll see what's salvageable out of that trim that's left. And then I'll go ahead and, uh, um, you know, use what I can. But we'll just, we'll go from there. But now, we got to get that guy out of here. Boo. Well, I don't want to bother the little guy. Anybody know what to do? Come on, little buddy. Come on, little buddy. It's not dead. Well, shucks. So I'll just call Paul and tell Paul to come in here and put the uh, fire extinguisher over the hole uh, tonight. So we'll just leave it alone and he'll be good for now, but enjoy your last night in the score tower, bud. Whoa, hope it didn't startle anybody. What is up? Yeah, so um, status on the bat, I'm not sure. Anyhow, um, back here at the house, got to get the RV Kind of fixed up as everybody knows uh we rented out not too long ago and um i got us well julie got it boom a faucet as you all know that's the one thing that's broken in here so we're gonna go install this faucet whoa oh, hope i didn't break it install this faucet in there you ready one two oh look at that you fell sideways also something else i need to uh take take those out and uh get some new ones Shut. I hope it's still good. So the one thing I don't have to uh, open it up to. Um, actually, I need to turn the battery on. 
Let's see if we gotta change this guy out right here. Sands, 13.7 volts. They got the battery shut. Whoa. Ooh. That took a deer. There's a battery shut off switch over here. Let's see right down here. There. Well actually. Dropped it down to 12 already. Yeah. Oh, nine, ten. Oh, that's just not gonna be good. We're just gonna go ahead and turn it back off. It's definitely still dirty from uh, that last rental. So we're gonna have to do this with no lights. Okay, I need to get a flashlight though. So I'm not sure how much of this you guys are gonna be able to see, but basically, I got to it's gonna be pretty easy. It shouldn't be too difficult, so. I think I can do it mostly by feel. I've already dumped it and cleaned it. Um, so we're good to go there. I just gotta vacuum it and clean it. Yeah, it's just, just unscrew it and that's it. All my feel. Ooh. I also put the faucet match. We're gonna go outside and we'll, we'll match them up. There's two and the faucet. All right, let me get up. There it is. All right. So it works. All right. I think we're golden. Yeah. So, these even fit back on it. They have new ones in here. But... Oh, there's instructions. Perfect. Totally missed that shot. I went up in the bag and everything's went everywhere. I was getting up. Rubber grommets with all the sink. Didn't have rubber grommets on the other one. I don't think. No. Negative. So again, for all you people out there, to save myself any heartache, I'm just gonna put it on just like this. I'll go ahead and use the new ones. So this pretty easy install. Boom, just like that. I'll go underneath. And guess what? Oh my feel. Man, it's getting too little in here. Yes, let me see. Let me get down here in position. Oh, I'll screw it all that together. We're good. I had a water hook up to try them out though. I'm sure to be fine. What I do? Damn water lines are getting in the way. Boy, they don't make it easy to get up in here. Double check them. All right. It's all tight as can be. Whew. Wanna see it? There it is. Now, I don't know what's off or on, but I'm like that for now. All right, now that's done. Next mission, get these batteries off. I'll just go turn that stuff away first. Make sure you shut. 
ら。あ、早いですからね。The next mission is going to pair pliers and take those off and get some new ones.